Welcome to Art History with Jackie. This week, we'll look at the history of watercolor painting. Watercolor refers to the method in which paints are made of pigments suspended in a water-based solution. Watercolor painting is an ancient form of painting that stems from Asia. In Asia, traditional Chinese painting with watercolors developed around 4000 BC, primarily as a decorative medium. By the first century AD, the art of painting religious murals had taken hold. By the 4th century, landscape watercolor painting in Asia had established itself as an independent art form. Watercolor painting has been used for manuscript illustration since Egyptian times and rose to prominence in illuminated manuscripts in the European Middle Ages. It became popular again during the Renaissance. An artist you may remember from last week's oil painting video, Albrecht Dürer, was a lead proponent of the medium during the Northern Renaissance. He used watercolor to paint botanical and wildlife illustrations, which continues to be one of the most important traditional uses of the medium. Botanical artists have traditionally been some of the most exacting and accomplished watercolor painters. During the 18th century, watercolor painting spread throughout England. Among the elite and aristocratic classes, watercolor painting was a symbol of a good education. Map makers, military officers, and engineers used it to depict properties, terrain, fortifications, etc. Watercolor artists were brought along on geological or archaeological expeditions to document discoveries. Among the significant watercolorists of the period were Thomas Gainsborough, John Robert Cousins, and Francis Town. From the late 18th century through the 19th century, the market for printed books and domestic art contributed to the growth of the medium. Watercolors were used as the basic document from which collectible landscape or tourist engravings were developed. The three English artists credited with establishing watercolor as an independent, mature painting medium are Paul Sandby, Thomas Girton, and Joseph Mallard William Turner. These artists elevated the medium to a point of refinement and power. Turner developed his painting in stages starting with large color areas on wet paper, then refining the image through washes and glazes. He was able to work with efficiency, and this method made him a multimillionaire. The popularity of watercolors stimulated many innovations, including heavier woven papers and brushes manufactured specifically for the medium. Watercolor tutorials established the step-by-step -step painting instructions that still characterize the genres today. Commercial brands of watercolor were marketed and paints were packaged in metal tubes or as dry cakes that could be dissolved in paint boxes, making it an accessible medium for amateur painters. Watercolor painting also became popular in the U.S. during the 19th century. The Hudson River School painters, such as William H. Bartlett and George Harvey, were influential artists of the period. Notably, American watercolor painting took on distinct regional styles, which can be seen through the development of different schools, such as the Ohio School of Watercolor Painting or the California Scene Painters. Watercolor painting continued to be popular in America during the 20th century. Artists such as Edward Hopper, Georgia O'Keeffe, and Wassily Kandinsky are notable proponents of the style. In this time, American watercolor painting imitated European Impressionism. The rise of abstract expressionism and the influence of amateur painters and advertising led to a temporary decline in the popularity of watercolor painting after 1950. Watercolor paint consists of four principal ingredients, a pigment, gum arabic as a binder, additives like glycerin, ox gall, honey and preservatives, and evaporating water, a solvent used to thin or dilute the paint for application. Since its inception, watercolor paints have become commercialized, and it is often a medium that amateur painters begin with. So let's try our hand at it. 